Hi everyone, thank you guys for joining. Uh, today is a very special video. I'm um, announcing the winner of my giveaway from um, two weeks ago. So I'm super excited. So stay tuned and watch until the end of this video. Um, I will not forget to announce the winner. Now, thank you guys for, for watching. I really appreciate it. Um, thank you for subscribing. Um, all my new subscribers, um, welcome. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, hit that subscribe button down below to subscribe for more shaving videos to come. Um, I'm sharing my wet shaving journey all the way from South Africa. Um, it's been a very special cup, um, I think a year, yes, a year and a half. I've been doing wet shaving um, and it's absolutely fantastic. Now the razor I'm shaving with today is a vintage razor. It's the Gillette pocket edition now they manufactured these razors um, from the mid um, 1910s um, and they stopped the, making the serial numbers at the bottom um, from the 1920s to the 1930s um, so this razor is somewhere between the 1920s and 1930s um, so this is very very common razor actually to find is one of my oldest razors I own at this moment. Um, it's an open comb and three piece razor. You can see there. Three piece razor. So I'm very excited to try this out and to shave with it. Another blade I'm going to use with that razor is the Gillette Nasset blade. And um, it comes in a paper wrapper like this um, this is now my second use with this blade so I'm just going to put that aside and the soap now the soap I'm using today is um, a soap that was sent to me by Fernando from Master Soap Creations and Yucky South Africa um, thank you so much Fernando I really appreciate it uh, thank you for all your support um, here is the soap it's the orange and cedar wood um, small batch artisan shave soap um, handcrafted in South Africa the soap from Master Soap Creations are, is absolutely stunning oh, this is fantastic I wish you could smell this I can smell the orange um, now the ingredients I'll also list them down below if you can see them here um, triple pressed uric acid, tallow, coconut oil, castor oil, avocado oil, shea butter, etc. But this scent is absolutely fantastic. Um, I can really smell the orange and the cedar wood. I don't get it as much, but I think if I whip out the lather, it would be perfect. Now, everybody who entered the giveaway from two weeks ago, this is going to be your prize. Not a specific brush, you'll get an absolutely new one. But I'm going to use this brush, so stay tuned to see how this brush performs. So let's make our lather. So I'm just going to scoop out some of that soap, put it in a bowl and make my lather. So I'll just stop recording to save some time. So see you guys in a bit. A few moments later. Okay, now my lather is all nice and creamy check that out and this scent is absolutely fantastic just smell it there wow um, the orange is really fantastic um, it reminds me of a time um, when I went to Spain in uh, the end of 2017 beginning of 2018 um, those Seville oranges it smells exactly like it. It's fantastic. Now the cedar wood is very subtle. It's not that strong, but it's there. It's very, very subtle. So I'm excited to shave with this. Look at that. Absolutely fantastic. Okay, so I'm just going to wet my face and apply that amazing, amazing lather. Okay. 
Okay. All right. Oh, that's fantastic. Oh, that scent is absolutely amazing. Um, I would actually shave with this um, type of soap in the summertime. Um, a nice fruity scent, orange scent. But uh, the season is changing. Spring is starting, so I think this is a perfect time to try this out. Now this soap is tallow based, which, which uh, makes it a fantastic um, soap, for, especially for your, all the skin properties it has. Um, so that's also very, very nice. Okay, I think that will do. go now I forgot to mention um, if you don't follow me on Facebook um, Instagram or Twitter make sure to check out in the description below I'm leaving links down there so you can find it easy um, to follow me on all those other um, social media platforms so go check it out okay so first pass with the Gillette pocket edition I'm very excited Ooh, I can Tell it's a very aggressive razor with the open comb, but wow, just look at that. Oh, that's absolutely amazing! So, so smooth already. Um, the Nasset blade is one of my favorites, so I think this is a perfect pairing. Wow, this is fantastic. I'm a huge fan of uh, aggressive razors. Um, Find it, find it more comfortable and just use cold water. This is absolutely stunning. Wow. So how are you guys been doing? I hope you guys are well and safe. This is fantastic. Oh, this is so nice. So what's your shave of the day? Please let me know in the comments below. Really like to know what are you guys shaving with? What's your newest mail call? Please let me know. I'm really curious uh, to know what you guys are shaving with. Oh, this is nice.
absolutely fantastic. Wow. That's really, really amazing. Right, just rinse the face and apply that second lather. Okay. Oh, that's super slick. One of Master Soap Creation's qualities. Super slick. Okay. This scent of the um, cedarwood is really very subtle, but I like it. Really amazing. Oh, this is fantastic. Now I'm just going to do a two pass shave today. Um, because I'm a little bit in a rush today. So, and I want to do the announcement for the winner of that giveaway. So just to save some time, I'm just going to do a two pass shave. Right, across the grain. Oh, that's fantastic. So nice. And for all those Formula One fans out there, super excited for the weekend. I think it's been a month since the last race. So I'm really excited. For the Formula One to kick off again. Oh, this is fantastic. Oh, that audio feedback, eh? is super addicting Just taking it slow in these areas. Oh, that's fantastic. Absolutely amazing, super smooth. I'm really tempted to do a third pass. Got myself there.
view next there it's because I'm rushing it a little bit but no closer shave than blood hey <laughs> so but this is really really fantastic I absolutely love vintage razors especially Gillette just in another class. Right, I think that's it. So I'm just gonna rinse my face with nice cold water. Oh wow, that's fantastic. Nice two pass shave. Oh, that's so, so nice. And only two passes, my face is already so smooth, but I can feel here against the grain a little bit. There's a little bit left, but this is perfect. Oh, that's nice. Okay, now to calm it down a little bit. I'm going to use, I've used this splash actually before. Um, it's from, it's the Citrus Melody from Master Splash Creations. See that there, the splash, absolutely fantastic. I'm keeping it to the citrus scent. So I'm just give it a few shakes. Oh, it has a nice menthol in it, but that citrus scent is fantastic. Oh, it will sort out this in a few nicks. Oh, this is so, so cooling. Oh, my eyes are tearing up from the menthol. A very, very strong menthol in it, um, which makes it very fantastic. And I like it. Okay. Now the balm I'm going to use is just a regular Nivea balm and the replenishing post-shave balm has a little bit of alcohol in it. I can't open it, so there we go. Just a little bit of that. Oh, lovely scent. Oh, that's fantastic. Oh, that's so, so nice. Okay. There we go. So just to recap, I've used the Gillette Pocket Edition with a Nasset blade. Um, second use, absolutely fantastic open comb razor. A very, um, it's not that aggressive um, um, as I thought initially. But it is aggressive, so don't make a mistake. That Nasset blade is absolutely fantastic um, with that. Um, I've used the Nivea Post Shave um, Replenishing Balm and the um, Citrus Melody Splash from Master Splash Creation, Creations. Absolutely fantastic. And then this amazing soap from Master Soap Creations, the Orange and Cedarwood um, Artisan Soap. Absolutely fantastic scent so get yours today um, I'll also leave a link to the, um, in the description to all the products I used um, so right let's get to it okay and I actually forgot I used this amazing yucky 24 millimeter knot black marbles plus soft synthetic brush um, also the brush the winner of this giveaway will receive. So let's get to it. Let me just rinse my hands. Okay. Oh, here's my iPad. So I'm here using the YouTube random comment picker. Let me just get the link to the video. Okay, there we are. 
So I'm just gonna paste the link in there. Um, include replies to comments, filter comments based on a specific text. And that text was hashtag subscribed. Subscribed, yes, there we go. Get YouTube comments. Oh, I didn't spell it correctly. Oh, oops. Right. There we go. Let's. There we go. Ten comments. Got ten comments. Oh, here it is. Start raffle and pick a random winner. So good luck, everybody. Here we go. Albertus Piazek, well done on winning my giveaway. Um, it's weird to see another Piazek winning um, a giveaway. Um, the last winner was Zantes Piazek, so I think you guys are related. I think Zantes told all his family about my channel, so thank you so much for that. But Albertus Piazek, congratulations for winning. Um, please send me an email to um, the wetshave cave at gmail.com um, to send me all your details so I can send you that amazing shaving brush. Also, another shout out to the sponsor of that shaving brush, Fernando from Master Soap Creations and Yucky South Africa. Thank you guys for watching. Please rem remember to like this video, subscribe if you're not subscribed, follow me on Instagram. Twitter and Facebook and also check out that PayPal link to support my channel if you would like to. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys next week for another special, very special shave. I'm doing my birthday shave. My birthday is on the 2nd of September. So the day before that, I'm going to use a very, very special shaving soap. So stay tuned for that. Thank you for the support. Have a wonderful day and a wonderful week. See you guys next week. Bye-bye.